Fetch AI is one of the few AI coins that I believe is going to give us more than a 10x in this bull market. And on today's video, I will be focusing on my long-term price prediction analysis, give you reasons why we can easily see more than a 10x in this bull market. And above all, discuss my short-term price prediction analysis, basing it on the additive structures. So make sure that you stick around to the end of the video and starting the video here on the daily chart you can see that last year we got our bear market lows and started an aggressive bounce to the upside in a move that gave us a high above the 3.479 completing the formation of this additive count one and after we picked in an additive count one I was expecting a bit of a short term pullback in an additive count two whose minimum target areas I have highlighted here on the charts using this blue target area, an area that we have now fully maximized. And there are high chances that we now have a low in place for this second wave, which can also be confirmed by the break of this descending trend line that I have here on the charts, which is an indication that we have started to see a change of structure of this downward movement that we had in the past few months. And this could be the start of an impulsive movement to the upper side in what I will be terming as the start of an impulsive additive count three, whose minimum target areas can be given by connecting the trend-based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that additive count one, then dragging the Fibs to the low of the second wave, giving me a minimum target area at the Fib level 1.618 that lies above the $6. And a bounce to that significant target area will easily give us a 5x to the upside. Then we can expect a bit of a short term pullback in an additive count 4, then continue gearing up even higher in an additive count 5 that can easily get us back above the $10 and give us our 10x to the upside. So that is my long-term price prediction analysis. Jumping to the 4-hour chart to now give you the significant key areas of support that we need to continue holding above. Basing my analysis on the edu 12 structures, you can see that from the loss that we made on the 5th of August, we have seen a very nice bounce to the upside in a 5-wave structure in a move that has now given us a high above the 1.739, completing the formation of this additive count one. And after we picked in that additive count one, I have been expecting that we are going to see a bit of a short term pullback in an additive count two, whose minimum target areas can be given by pulling the fibs from the lows that we made on the 5th of August to the highs that we made above the 1.7444 giving me a minimum pullback target area into the golden pocket and that lies between the FIB level 0 0.5 and the FIB level 0 0.618 and that is between the 1.224 and the 1.101 which is the area over here so in the next coming hours in case we start any sudden pullbacks maybe losing support above the 1.4 then there are high chances that we are going to fully maximize this target area get a low in place for the second wave, see much of a consolidation before we can finally bounce to the upside in an additive count three. So that is all I'm expecting here on the, on the Fetch AI chart for the next coming hours. And let's be patient and see how that plays out. And I will be keeping you up to date.